Good evening, I'm First No Meteorologist Ivy Winch, and we've had a pretty dry weekend so far. Some showers in Liberty and Franklin counties earlier today, those are now subsiding, and the rest of the region has remained dry and will stay dry throughout the evening hours. And a lot of sunshine in store once again for our Sunday morning. More moisture does work its way into the forecast, though, and then some isolated to scattered storms are possible Sunday evening and then each evening afterwards as we head into the work week. And right now we could see the reason for the dry weather, a low pressure system now moving out of the area and a high pressure system off to our south and our west. It's filtered in some drier air from the north, but as we head over the next, you know, day or so, we start to see those areas of high and low pressure move away from the region and instead we'll start to see a wind flow more out of the south southwest. That's going to help bring in that moisture to our area, but Sunday morning, lots of sunshine, not expecting really those rain chances to start until the afternoon hours, and then we could see an isolated to scattered storm pop up in the afternoon, but I think the majority of the region will still stay on the dry side and any storms that do pop up should be brief in nature. But temperature wise, we are also going to be seeing you know warmer temperatures for Sunday, but then it gets a little bit cooler in terms of temperatures as we head into your Monday because of that increased humidity. But the feel like temperatures will be a little bit higher and it'll feel a little bit more muggy out there. So you're not going to notice feel all, it feel all that cooler. But we could see tonight temperatures dipping down into the mid 70s, warming up into the mid to upper 90s tomorrow afternoon, depending on where those storms decide to pop up. And then overnight Monday morning in the 70s by the afternoon will be in the 90s here, showing maybe the potential for some storms to cool us off Monday afternoon. But heading towards the beach, 89 degrees will be that high temperature tomorrow. Moderate risk of rip currents, so not entirely impossible to get out in the waters, but still apply that sunscreen with a high UV index. And we can notice too, if we go out into the tropics, no tropical cyclone development expected over the next seven days, so we're staying calm out there, luckily. And as we head throughout the next seven days, we can expect those afternoon scattered storms to pop back into the forecast Monday afternoon and last throughout the work week into next weekend. Highs in the mid 90s, but it will feel warmer than that because of that increased humidity in the forecast. Overnight lows in the mid 70s throughout the week, so staying comfortable and humid at night.